Uncle Joy Weathers Bay and Aunt Nancy Smith on a visit to New York by Mr. Cal Stewart. <laughs> well, a long last summer, I was getting ready to come down here to New York. Yes, nothing would do Aunt Nancy Smith, but she must come along, I says. Now, look here, Nancy, I know darn well. If I take you down to New York, I'll have to tie you up a telegraph for three or four days and get you used to the gear. <laughs> well, nothing would do, Nancy, but she must come along. So we got down here. We was walking around looking at the things, and all at once Nancy says to me, Gee whiz, Joyce, just look at them our butter beans. <laughs> I says, Nancy, you silly old goose, them's bananas. Well, we walked around about a half an hour longer, and all at once Nancy just grabbed me by the arm and jumped right up in the air and blotted out like a dying calf. I said, what's the matter with you, Nancy? Are you going to have a conniption fit right here in New York City? She said, gosh, away with her, bitch. I want to go right straight home. I never was in a town in my life where they had to start nation doing why Joshua just look his eye. There's a fellow's horses run away and he's trotting right up there on the wagon and don't know the fuck thing about it. <laughs> I says, Nancy, that's one of them automobile wagons. Well, then we got on a boat and went down to Coney Island, had a pretty good time and when we was coming home in the evening, there was a band on the boat to play in something like this. Well, that boat got to bobbing up and down, cutting up didos, and I didn't feel very good, but it didn't bother Nancy any. She kept right on talking. She said, Joshua, ain't this a lovely evening? Joshua, do you think the moon will be up this evening, Joshua? <laughs> I says, I'll be darned if I know, Nancy, but the way I'm a feeling, if I let that gosh darned old moon, it'll be up. <laughs> 